What is going on? Stud muffins, eight thoughts back with the alpha male swag, baby. Bros, guys, listen, Activision Blizzard, the greatest publishing company in the world, woo, uh, is, is back with some more, well, hey, you know, big surprise. Let's say it's a big surprise, you know, but they're back with some more money grubbing schemes. Uh, like the title says, they're going to be raising the money on next gen console games, and they're citing that it costs more to develop these games, so they got to charge more. Even though the microtransactions and the profits that Activision is making and Blizzard is making, uh, you know what, just sort of seem to, uh, you know, be billions and zillions of dollars. And uh, it's, it's, it's amazing that they're making more money off of microtransactions than ever before on games, but yet they feel the need to tell us that it costs more to develop these games. We have to raise prices because we're not making enough profits. Hey, man, Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Make sure to check out the new bundle in the store, guys. Make sure to go buy it. Go buy it. Go buy the new microtransactions. <laughs> you know, I have a quick question, though. I got a quick question to ask you. I got asked you guys something here at Activision Blizzard. And anybody out here who is going to hit that dislike button on this video because you're an Activision paid Call of Duty shill, not call anybody named out of I'm going to ask you a question. Let me ask you something. Where's Epic Games in all this? They have a free-to-play game, developmentals off the charts that goes, you know, that's a free-to-game, play game, eight thoughts, there's no campaign, you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, I don't want to talk to you, eight thoughts, that's a free-to-play game, and it only campaign, and it doesn't really, you know, no, no, that's not the same thing, eight thoughts, I don't care if they're making billions of dollars off of microtransactions, the game's free-to-play, and it's the most money any game has ever made in the history of gaming, I don't care about those facts, eight thoughts, my feelings are more important than facts, Jack. Yeah, I just want, to, just want to put that out there. You know what I'm saying? Like Epic Games free to play. I don't see them complaining about the you know, game costs or developmental costs of a game. But no, Activision, of course, needs to get more money. And uh, I support them fully. I bought every Call of Duty from the, from the jump. And uh, I'm nothing but a uh, hypocritical, not put my mouth where my money is, uh, YouTuber uh, making a video complaining about that fact. Because uh, even though they're complaining, I guarantee you, guarantee almost all of you watching this video and... Uh, Will be the number one selling game again, Call of Duty 2020 or 2021, whenever Black Ops Cold War, Black Ops Cold Sore comes out, whatever, Black Ops Zeus, I don't know what the hell you call it. Just don't call me late for dinner. Oh, dad Joe with the swag no shirt. So, ah, uh, gotta love Activision. So, just to reiterate my points, Activision can pound some serious sand. They uh, want to charge more for next-gen uh, games because it costs more to develop them, even though their microtransaction makes them zillions, zillions of dollars, and profits are always through the roof. Uh, it's not good enough for them. And, uh, yeah, that's it. In a nutshell. This is me in a nutshell. I'm in a nutshell. Let me out. Ah, boom! Dad joke number two. All right, I'm out. Thanks for watching. I think I just spat on myself. Be cool, stay in school, stay no drugs, and last but not least, and most importantly, stay black. Question 30. And don't let the honky cracker, reptilian shapeshifter, bring it down.